cauliflower is the name of the game these days you guys there are so many delicious ways to use your cauliflower and i have figured out a brand new way that i'm absolutely in love with mediterranean style cauliflower salad prepared tabbouleh style i'm a tabbouleh nut and i'm super excited to show you how this goes I'm Susie with TheMediterraneanDish.com. I'm all about easy, wholesome recipes with big Mediterranean flavors. And let's make this beautiful Mediterranean cauliflower salad. All right, the star ingredient is cauliflower. This is one full head of cauliflower that I have taken the time. Look at me, I'm like prepared. <laughs> I've taken the time to cut it up into florets and it is ready to go into my food processor. Now, the reason that I say this is gonna be a tabbouleh style salad is that everything is chopped up so nice and small. With the cauliflower, we're gonna grind it super fine until it mimics like a cauliflower rice or the bulgur in tabbouleh. So let's get our cauliflower right into our food processor. Every single little bit. All right, so we've got our cauliflower. This is the entire head, so make sure that you're using a large food processor to do this bit here. We're gonna pulse a few times until we arrive at just the right texture. All right, let's see. This is perfect. This is what I'm looking for, you guys. For people who can't eat cauliflower raw, including myself, this is such a great way to do it. It's super finely ground, so you don't have, you know, the whole big cauliflower to deal with. I absolutely love to do cauliflower this way. From here, really everything will go into my big bowl. We're gonna dress it up and it's gonna be absolutely delicious. So for uh, additional star ingredients, we have tomatoes, cucumbers, and red onions. I have a couple garlic cloves that will go in as flavor makers at the end. So that's really it. I'm going to chop up some parsley because parsley is a big ingredient here. Now I'm using an entire bunch of Italian parsley. I find that it has a little bit more flavor than curly parsley and it's easier to deal with. Then collect the parsley and go again one more time because we want to finely chop it. Anchor your knife down this way and kind of just go back and forth like a fan. I think this is looking good, finally. <laughs> Let's get our baby in here, our cauliflower. You'll notice it kind of mimics the texture of bulgur wheat, which is an ingredient used in our traditional tabbouleh. It kind of makes a lot. So this is a huge salad that you can serve, you know, when you're hosting a big party or eat it for lunch a few days in a row, it holds up pretty well. Roma tomatoes is what I'm using here. Any tomato will do. I used about three to four Roma tomatoes. Now the key here, you guys, I'm using English cucumbers. Those are the long ones that have very thin skin and they're also seedless, so they taste much better and you don't have to do the whole work of peeling them because their skins are super soft. Next, we have onions, about a half an onion here. Give or take, you guys, I know onion can be super strong, so kind of like ease into it. I'm gonna add a whole bunch of parsley, finely chopped. Give it a quick toss. Two garlic cloves, one if you're not a big garlic fan, I am, so we're going for two. Kind of take your aggression out on it. Here we go. And again, point your knife and go at it. I have a traditional tabbouleh recipe, by the way, on the MediterraneanDish.com, so if that's what you're looking for. But people often ask me for like, what's the gluten-free version, what's the low-carb version, all sorts of stuff. So if that is you, I'd give this recipe a try. I think this is looking good, finally. So let's add our garlic cloves right in here. I'm gonna kinda give them a sprinkle so they're evenly distributed. Next, pinch of salt and pepper. Kosher salt is what I use. Pepper. Let's add our liquids. Two lemons. 
We need two lemons because we want to soften our cauliflower a little bit and we want to kind of just infuse all sorts of brightness into the salad. So I'm using juice of two full and juicy lemons. And I cup my hands this way so I can grab whatever seeds. Trick I learned from my mommy, who's super good in the kitchen. <laughs> Trust me, I know this looks like a lot of lemon, but this salad absolutely needs it. The cauliflower, when it kind of softens and takes on all the beautiful fresh flavors, is just absolutely gorgeous. Last but not least, early harvest extra virgin olive oil straight from Greece. You guys, if you don't have this, you have to try it. It is available on themediterraneandish.com. Just hit the shop tab, check it out. We just got a brand new shipment. All we have to do now is give this baby a toss. Make sure everything is well combined. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait to dig into this. Cauliflower salad tabbouleh style. Grab the recipe on the mediterraneandish.com and I will see you later. Ciao.